Hi guys. So I read another chapter in my book last night. My Final Breath. Again, it's a pretty good book. Um, and I'm going to take my shower now, so... reading a chapter. I oh, oh, you my mind. Okay, <laughs> here's my food. Yummy. <laughs> I'm gonna donkey eat it now. <laughs> Are you still videoing? Yep. The bacon is good. Pour my syrup on my thing. Ooh. You are, you know, trying to get at you, get on your nerves, you know. Or maybe, like I said, maybe she was suicidal, and maybe she wanted me to kill her. Any <laughs> Hello. Martin, Nora and I are at IHOP eating lunch. 
What do I always get when I go somewhere? Yes. <laughs> I'm with Nora till three, so. In that tube, isn't Rogan's yeah. over here? Well, where the heck is Rogan? I know Rogan's is over here. Bath and body work. I mean, Rogan didn't move out of here, did they? No, they couldn't have. I wonder, Nora. I could have sworn this was Rogan. so drained guys it's not funny I need a nap <sighs> yeah I think I'm gonna take a nap guys I'm just warm in here. I'm just tired. Well, it's just, my God, what happened to make me feel this way, you know? It's insane. <sighs> Looks like it's going to rain or something, too. <sighs> Alright, I'm going to lay down for a little bit. This time I will set my alarm so I don't wake up at 8 because that day was insane. Someone is mowing the lawn, but I don't know if I'll be getting them in my time lapse, hyperlapse thing. So if you see them, you see them. I don't know if it will rain or not. We have dark clouds, so that'd be interesting to see the clouds pass and go, huh? But I'm gonna get a, a drink of my stuff that I was drinking, and then I'm gonna lay back down, lay down. I didn't lay down yet but you know all right why is this so dang loose i don't understand
Hi guys, nothing up for a little tiny bit with E, there's E right there, so I'm gonna get my boobies dressed here, yes I'm kind of sleeping sneaky to get comfortable and feel comfortable in my bed, I'm feeling so much better since that nap, I tell ya. <clears throat> And the thing though is, after when I got done eating my pancakes there, my poop hole had to barf a couple of times. Sorry about the TMI, did I tell you this? I don't know, but yeah. And I had a issue last night with my poop hole doing that. Jesus Louise. So, I'm gonna get dressed again here and uh, read from my book. G46 I22 G50 
Chanel number five. What are you wearing? Hi, you guys. Well, I'm gonna go to bed, and, um, you know, I'm just gonna fall asleep and do a time lapse outside my window. If I wake up in between, like, going to the bathroom, I will, um, stop it and then press record, but, you know, and I'm gonna share with you something. These are the new shoes I got today. See? This is the, what the bottom looks like. The top. It has an S on here for Skechers. And it says Arc Fit right here. Arc Fit. I don't know if you can see it, but Arc Fit right here. So these are really comfortable. It feels like I'm bouncing on a cloud, so it, they, these were $95. I only took out 80 from the bank, and then I had to um, use my credit card for the extra 15 bucks. And I had Kim use my um, coupon and for her other shoes she wants. And so... Um, I read 10 chapters in here, 35 to 45, and I'm this far into it. It's hard for me to decide which other book I want from her because I was like looking at the lengths of her other books and I'm trying to decide between Never Be Alone and When Smiles Fade and Mean Little People. Because someone said on the um, review for When Smiles Fade, I gotta read first Mean Little People. And Mean Little Peeper, People have, have like 500 pages, so it might be like this thick or so. So I don't know which one I want to read first. Maybe Never Be Alone, maybe. Because um, it says... Uh, in the back here, and yes, I did peek at the back. Read about June, J O O N, the homeless teenager who hooked Molly. Follow June and Lulu, her friend Lulu, homeless teenagers surviving the streets of Philadelphia from my novel Never Be Alone. And she has like the. Sample. Sorry, as I was saying, it cut off. She has a sample, like um, like the prologue. It says uh, the new family, and then it goes like one, wait, two, four, five pages, and then chapter one, and then two pages of chapter one, and um. And then chapter two, three years later, 
One, two, three, four. Um, and in chapter, in this book, 46, chapter 46, and um, through, I think, um, wait, let me see when they, I'm trying to see where okay I think chapter 40 is where um they introduce the um, author page introduced j-o-o-n into this book and um, and so she brought Molly she interviewed Molly into the streets to show her what it's like, you know? So, yeah, she feels free and everything, but... But yeah, now I'm gonna go to bed because I feel pretty tired. My eyes look like they've been punched, you know? I looked at myself in the mirror and they look like they've been punched, so... I'm gonna get ready for bed now and go to bed. And so again... Um, I'm gonna just film the outside, and if I snooze all through the night, then yes, I guess I can combine this video along with Tuesday or something. I don't know, but I really don't feel like doing that, to be honest with you, combining videos. It's just, you know, <sighs> I don't know. Oh, and about, uh, Power Director, um... It gave me like this pop-up once it crashed and then I said it keeps crashing and then I sent them my email and then it you know went away the pop-up so I hope the support people read that for from power director so I just wanted to update you on that so have a good night everybody have a good day okay good grief I said the wrong word again not interview her to the streets introduced her to the streets <sighs> she introduced her to the streets of philadelphia because uh, molly was curious of her lifestyle of being homeless so that's what's happening in my final breath right now so yeah um and yes molly is in heaven watching her past self do all this so she's showing gwen her um a guardian angel or whatever her guardian helper angel thing well it explains in the book who it is and stuff so alrighty again